Well, this is Jeffrey, my barred owl. That's uh, one of my education birds. And I've had Jeffrey for five years now. And um, I went out this morning, and he was lying down on his perch. And he had this horrible expression on his face. And, oh, my God, I thought he was dying. And I just ran down to the house. I got my gloves. I came back. I scooped him up and brought him down here to the house because I wanted him to be nice and warm. And if he was going to die, I just, because, you know, he was an adult when I got him. So I have no idea how old he is. Um, so if he was going to die, I wanted him to die and you know, in a nice comfy room, and so I brought him down here, and uh, this was about an hour ago, and I just came in to check on him, and <laughs> Jeffrey is a Justine. She just laid her first egg for me in the five years that I've had her. I guess, um, when they're in captivity, maybe they don't start till later. I know my red tail Mina was, I had her eight years. She was ten before she laid her first egg. I don't know if being in captivity um, and having no stimulation from the male makes any difference. But anyway, um, th this is an owl egg and it's still warm. I wish you could feel it. Wish we had feel a vision. Uh oh. <laughs> and <laughs> see how tough they are? Ugh. But uh, they're, they're kind of round. They're not elliptical like a chicken egg. They're a little bit elliptical, but not too much. See, there's still, still some traces of blood on it. Um, anyway, he's like, she's like, uh, is that mine? What am I supposed to do with it? Well, obviously, it's not fertile. Um, so, uh, I guess I'll uh, keep it not put it in with my chicken eggs because I don't want to get it mixed up with anybody but anyway uh, the expression on her face is a lot different uh, mostly one of relief at this point uh, anyway it was a weird day <laughs> signing out from Hawk Talk headquarters